The time is getting near and there is some simple things we should go over before the release of New World. So make sure to hit that like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon to be notified on all New World content. So let's begin. The closed beta begins on July 20th and ends on August 2nd, if you pre-ordered the game that is. Some things to note here is the character progression isn't carried over to final release, so get comfortable, get the feeling of the game, but don't get attached unless you're willing to start fresh. Which if you wish to participate in the beta, you do have two options. You can either sign up to be a tester via the New World game website or just pre-order the game. With two different versions of the game that you can get, being the Deluxe Edition and the Standard Edition, the Deluxe Edition basically giving you some extra skins, pets, some extra emotes, and a digital art book, along with, you know, some beta access, Elizabeth's amulet, unique title, emote, guild crest set, so on and so forth. That's what, pretty much what you get. And just to clarify, you get the beta invite regardless of which version of the game you get. Next, I'm looking to start a company in New World and need some names, so leave some name suggestions down below. Preferably English speaking, both casual and serious players are welcome. Goals are to, you know, kind of achieve claiming a region, doing quests as groups, helping newer players and having a solid pipeline of information to flow between the members. Would be awesome if we could have some specialized players for different crafting skills and skill sets, so let me know some names down below. I'm leaning towards Syndicate currently, as usually like to play mage setups or, you know, Major Rogue is usually my go-to. So make sure to jump into the Discord and keep up with the community. Currently there is no plans for separate servers as far as roleplay or PvP centric servers. Amazon Games has said they didn't want to split up the community, which I kinda get. So let's hope we can see an RP server down the road hopefully. Would love to give that a shot, but for all the players hoping that segregated servers would be a thing, sorry for the bad news guys however if you are worried about partaking in pvp just make sure you're not having the pvp flag and you will experience will be tailored to your style so you don't have to worry about some punk trying to trying to kill you so with these nuggets you might be curious on if there is a roadmap or future content well the game isn't out yet and i honestly prefer that they aren't set in stone yet and or public about it let them focus on the experience and make launch great they say they will have a roadmap at launch so be ready for that then from what I'm seeing and from the chatter, it's going to be a PvE focused. Think of Destiny 2 raids. They recently did just release a video that included Outpost Rush 101, basically giving a little bit further breakdown. So we'll be giving our thoughts about that within the next week or so. So keep an eye out for that. I'm definitely curious and would like to see that the changes that they have made since Alpha and really get my hands on it. So here was a quick rundown and hopefully answered a couple of questions as the days Nick tick near zero. Join the Discord to discuss some new world content, join our company, and let's rule together. This was Feb, and until next time, guys, have a good night.